Hey guys, welcome back to Daybreak. As you know, every week we have Gina come in from the Humane Society and bring us some animals that need a good home. And I mean, today you got one that's a bubble of personality here. He is. This is Bear. I don't know what he's looking at over there. Bear. You know your name, don't you? And he's a Rottweiler mix. He's about four months old. And how do you know that he's a Rottweiler mix? That's just what we're assuming. Just about what he looks like. He's kind of got a longer nose than a Rottweiler. So. And how old do you think he is? Uh, he's four months old. Four months old. And uh, you know, you said earlier that he's like a shoebox puppy. What, no, that's the other ones. Other ones. That's the other ones. Okay. Yeah. So when Bear comes in, uh, does he need what? What does he need? Does he need to get fixed or? Yes, he needs to get fixed, and that goes with his adoption fee. That's ninety-five or one hundred and ten dollars for a puppy. Okay. And that includes a mandatory proper test, okay. first set of shots, his neuter, and a microchip. Microchip. Mm -hmm. All right. So you got a whole bundle of things here. Yes. But you I mean you got. A great dog. Yes, he is a great dog. He's actually, I don't know what he's interested in over there, but I can see what he's, he's interested in. He's as quiet as he's been <laughs> since we got here. <laughs> I, well, earlier he was playing around and he had a bubble of energy and he was just playing with Eric earlier, you know, our camera guy here. And uh, he's, he's, he hasn't barked any. Right, he's calmed down. He's not whining anymore. Great dog. Look, look you're a movie now, star. Now, what is going on over at the Humane Society? All kinds of stuff is going on in the Humane Society. It's almost summer. That's a really busy season for us. That's puppy season. And so we're just gearing up for to be full. All right, now where can people find Bear at? At 3501 South Osage in the south entrance. We're open 10 to 7 Monday through Friday. All right, now stick with us because we got a whole lot more coming up. You have, what, three more dogs for us? Three more dogs and a cat. Yeah, three more dogs and a cat. So be sure to keep watching Daybreak. Meredith and Steve. Cute pup. Oh, look at her. No, I love it. She got puppy dog eyes. Well, starting in April. Hey, Meredith. Now, Gina's back, and we've got two animals here, a cat and a dog. And let's start off with what the one you're holding, Scarlett. And this is Scarlett. She's about one to two years old. She was brought to us by Animal Control, and she was injured. So we fixed her, and now she's ready for adoption. And how old is she? Uh, one to two. One to two. Um, and this one over here that I've got. That's Robin. Rob like Batman and Robin. Batman and Robin. He's a... a, a Dachshund mix. He's trying to get away is what he's trying to do. He is. He's about seven to eight weeks old, and he is, uh, he's a cutie. Now, what about their personalities? Well, they, <laughs> they'll develop as, as, she, as they grow. Well, I'm sure since she's about one to two, she might have a little bit of one. Yeah, she's a very, very sweet kitty. She hasn't, well, I've, while you've been sitting over here petting her, she's uh She kind of wants to purring. escape now. I can see that. Now, what happened to her leg? Um, that was where her IV was. Oh, okay. Yeah, she she uh, actually had a miscarriage, and they oh. took care of her at the vet, and now she's ready to go home. Ready to go home, but not with me. <laughs> <laughs> I can't have one yet, but man. Um, now this one, and I'm looking at him, and he's not shedding a whole lot, which is a good thing. Cause right. Now, yeah. do uh, dachshunds shed? Because I know that he's a dachshund mix. Well, everything sheds. Right. Um, but, yeah, they don't shed as much as, say, you know, Long-haired dogs. Right. He, he will not be long-haired. Where, where can they find him again? At 3501 South Osage in the south entrance. And do you guys have a phone number that they can reach We out? do. It's 373-1716. Okay. And we're open 10 to 7 Monday through Friday. 10 to 7 Monday through Friday. Scarlet yeah. wants to escape. <laughs> so it is Robin over here. <laughs> he can't escape just yet. But guys, now coming up a little bit later on, Gina has something that are called shoebox puppies. Shoebox puppies. Uh, they were brought to us at one day old in a shoebox, and there were eight of them, and we have two left, and I've brought both of them. All right. Well, they're going to be in the studio live here in just a little bit, so be sure to keep watching. Hey guys, welcome back to Daybreak. As you know, Gina from the Humane Society is here every week and she brings all kinds of animals for us to play with. Now, let's talk a little bit about the ones that we've got in our hands right now. These are the last two of the shoebox puppies. They okay. were brought to us at one day old in a shoebox and thanks to two awesome foster homes, we were able to save them all. Well, let's talk about the one that's in your hand. Who, who's he? This is, his name is Gus. His name used to be Goat Boy because he would only drink goat milk. Really? He, he refused the puppy formula. He only wanted the goat milk. And that's Zeus. And Zeus has a little cherry eye. And that's what um, is kind of his red eye on his right side. Yes. And that can's fixable. That's fixable. Yes, it is fixable. Um, they're about eight weeks old, I think, eight or nine weeks old. 
and they are ready to go home. Well, we think they're probably Basset Hound Terrier mix. As you, I mean, they, these are brothers. So and they came from the same litter. Came from the same litter. They yeah. totally look different. Yeah, when you said that, I was like, no, they didn't. Uh -huh. Yes, they did. <laughs> but you could tell this one's kind of a little bit of Basset Hound. Yeah, he's those got those the little ears. Basset Hound ears. And this one is obviously more terrier. So that's a Basset Hound Terrier mix, y'all are thinking. That's what we're thinking. All right. Now, where can they find them at? They can find them at 3501 South Osage in the south entrance. And we're open from 10 to 7 Monday through Friday. So Gus and... Zeus. Zeus. Gus and Zeus can be found at 3501 South Osage. Now, what's going on at the Humane Society this, this month? Um, this month, we're just doing business as usual. It's almost puppy season. We're getting ready to be slammed. We always get a bunch of puppies and kittens around this time because it's spring, and that's when most litters are born. So the, the pound really fills up, and we get them out as fast as we can. Now, do you all get a lot of shoebox puppies? Um, we get a lot of sh of shoebox items. <laughs> we get a, a lot of things left at our front door. Oh, okay. Um, probably once a week, I show up for work and there's something either tied to the flagpole or in a box outside. It happens all the time. Well, this is a good way to help these puppies that need homes, the kittens yes, and cats and exactly. everything. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, we got not only puppies and not only puppies, but, but cats, cats, everything, rabbits. People drop stuff off all the time. A duck. We had a duck last week. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you, Gina, so much. Thank you. Now, coming up a little bit later on after the break, Chef Chin is here to whip up something that I mean, it smells delicious.